I used to play a game with myself as a kid because I grew up on all these dirt roads. I would walk in the middle of the road with my eyes closed, and I would try and see how far I could go without opening my eyes. And you just tap into just this crazy right around you moment. There's a cadence of your feet hitting the ground. It's almost like a mantra. It's the music of running, really. In 2011, October, I was on a backcountry hike and I saw a pile of black fur and some claws sitting in the bottom of this drainage. I pulled my knife out, being very curious, and when I went to check it out, um, 2400 volts was running to that metal can from underground, uh, unprotected, and uh, arced into my knife and um, through my body and it exited in nine different places. I had nine exit wounds. So every day uh, is like another opportunity to push a little harder and to figure out how to like milk more out of my life, like daily. My language is food. For 18 years, I've been cooking for people in restaurants, on yachts, in private homes. But I've got this crazy passion for what is growing in its truest form possible. How do I do it sustainably? How do I do it with ethics? How do I do it responsibly? And then how do you cook them without really messing with them too much? To forage, you gotta slow down. You gotta pay attention. You gotta listen, you gotta tune in. Lift up a rock, look under a branch. Think about the meal ahead, you know? Foraging in the woods, when I'm fly fishing in the middle of the rain, um, and then when I go for a run. Running is part of my recipe, it's part of my equation. You pick up this rhythmic cadence of your heart, in tune with your mind, in tune with, with your spirit and your soul. It's a pretty key part in me owning my injury. To run is to keep me in the outdoors, is to keep that connection with that out there. Cooking in restaurants for so long, I felt disconnected from why we're alive today. Food and meals should enrich our lives, not just our bodies. It's really nice to cook and share a meal together, to get their hands involved. They're showing up and there's like dirt on the table and all this like natural organic matter from like just came out of the ground. That, that'll start a conversation. Like, dude, did you just pick these? Yeah, I did, let's clean them up. You know? And it'll look like a leak, like just that center right there. Then maybe a story will come out of you about a dish your grandparents used to make and the one you're making with me reminds you of it. Be enriched by the larger picture of nutrition. Make it a complete cultural thing. Yeah, that's like the stuff, you know? As a chef, moving forward in life, my focus is going to be using food as my language to connect with other people. Finding my strong is not a physical thing. It's a quiet thing. The challenge of being completely true to myself. My name is Eduardo Garcia. and um, I'm looking for life.